figure below shows a sensor that produces an output of um, B of T uh, as a function of input C of T. So the static trans function determines the output uh, when the input is not changing in time. To specify the time response or the dynamic transfer function, the nature of the time variation in output Bt is given when the input exhibit a step change as shown below here. Note that at t equals to 0, the input to the sensor suddenly change from Ci into Cf. If the sensor were perfect, the output would be determined by the static transfer function to be bi before uh, the step input here and bf after the step input. However, all sensors exhibit some lag between the output and the input and some characteristic variation in time before settling on the final value.